the Venice of the Cotswolds. That's what visitors call the picture postcard village of Borton on the Water. But there's nothing Venetian about the residents of nearby Birdland, an exclusive riverside home where flamingos are among the 600 birds who actually appreciate freedom in this luxury zoo. They've got the scent of herrings in their penguin beaks, and headkeeper John Midwinter never has to carry the can for losing any of his following, even though many of the birds are free to come and go as they wish. The feathered residents here at Birdland like this taste of luxury, so why go and fish around elsewhere? Not even a six-figure offer could persuade Len Hill to sell the Birdland paradise he created in 1956. Oh no, friendship with George the Macaw is more than a nodding acquaintance. And even Juno, the African parrot, seems to have tossed aside his jungle habits. Talk about a back scratcher, Juno's always itching to show off his party tricks for the benefit of feathered friends. George and Joe are great favourites with daughter Rosemary, and so too are the pelicans, who always seem anxious to get in the picture. And quite a different picture it is to the one which greeted Mr Hill when he first took over the derelict house and gardens. Now there's even treetop comfort for the macaws, though they always take a bit of persuading at bedtime. This handsome fellow really deserves star billing. And like all stars, the toucan can sometimes be temperamental in front of the cameras. But they'll never refuse any titbit from the thousands who come to Birdland. Yes, life here is very leisurely. But just glance at the lifelike features in these faces.